Hey guys and welcome back to Let's Play Catacombs 3D The Descent um, I'm going to switch the music in the game off for this one So I might add in some music of my own We'll see what I feel like when I process the video But yeah, we're going to continue from the second floor uh, So as you can see, when you when you load the game, the game's conveniently pause, Which is nice since there's an enemy right in front of me One of these little things I don't know what they are who, who knows? I'm gonna kill him anyway. Derp. Right. So, where to? We've got a few different ways to go here. No doubt they'll all be full of enemies. So, let's kill this guy, grab the treasure. We're in the lounge, apparently. One of the fun things about this game is it's like all the all the rooms that you go in have got like a, a name. So, you know, this is second floor hallway. Um, if we go around here, this is still in the second floor hallway, so that's not a good example. But the, yeah, you, you, it kind of tries to give you a little bit of a feel, which is it's nice, you know, considering the, the, the levels themselves are generally pretty... Um, they're, they're quite kind of uniform, really. There's only a couple of different wall textures in the game and that kind of thing, so uh, we're in the reading room now. It kind of gives it a little bit of a variety, which it might not have otherwise, um, I suppose. So, here's a key. Key, 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 key. Now, there are several red doors here. Uh, we have one key. Right, there, there's a couple of other doors. So, I'm going to go down to this one first of all, see what's in here. Derp. And we have a bolt power up. And another red key. So I'm gonna go along to the other one at the bottom of this side. And what's in here? Some health. Now although the, the, the heels like although it could have only shows about ten or so on the the bar at the bottom, you can actually hold more than that. I don't think there's any limit to how many you can hold, actually. Because if I use one, you can see the, the, if you look at the character's face in the top right there, he's started to lose a little bit of health, so I must have taken a hit somewhere along the line there. Um, if I press H to use a heal potion, it will go back to full health. And I've still got a full lot of bars at the bottom there. So, yeah, we've. I, I don't really know how we can check exactly how many we've got, but as long as we've got lots, that's really all that matters. So, let's go through here now. Again, there's multiple red doors to choose from here, so let's go this way first. And grab that. There's another key. Uh, so let's continue going this way. Uh, here's a blue key. And another red key, and a secret treasure room. So, you know, you always want to be shooting all the, the walls just in case you come across something secret like that. There are secret things all over the place in this game. Now, we'll go through this door. The war room. If there's anything else in here, it doesn't really look like it. There's a blue door, which we have the key for, and also a red door, which we also have the key for. And there's the portal out of here. So, da -da 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 -da. I think we've pretty much got everything we need from here. Let's go through the gate. So, we're entering the third floor now. Once again, it's throwing us straight into the action, and here's some tough guys. Let's kill these quickly. So there's some treasure here. This level, I think, becomes a bit more maze-like. There's a few uh, secret areas that you need to unlock here to, to actually make progress. Um, First of all, we'll head down this way. Kill this dude. Now, that seems... Yeah, a lot of these kind of square walled-in areas are actually hollow. So you can shoot them open and get stuff. This is a magic testing chamber, apparently. Which means that it's going to contain magic stuff. 
Doctor. No, we'll go down this way. We'll need a blue key to get in there. Let's kill off these guys first. And here's another way in. This one doesn't seem to have any enemies in it. It's a dust-filled room. Probably derelict for quite a long time. Ah. The only thing that really... This is a pretty fun game, to be honest, but the, the only thing that kind of annoys me about it is it's so painfully slow to turn around. Um, it's kind of annoying at times, but... Okay, what's in here? Just a bunch of storagey stuff, some nukes, and some bolts. I haven't really demonstrated these yet, but I'm not going to just yet because we don't really need to use them yet, and I don't want to waste them. Um, and they come in fairly short supply compared to like the healing potions. You know, there, there aren't an awful lot of nukes and bolts and that kind of thing. Do, 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 do. Right, there's the red key in the trolls there. So I take it these green guys are trolls then. Um, that would make sense. Now the yellow key, I think, to go in there. But we can use the red key to get in here. So let's do that. Anyone in here? Anybody we don't want to see? Uh, no enemies. Okay. Well, that gets us the yellow key. Um, let's move back to the yellow door. And we will go in there. And there's a trolls. Trolls, 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 trolls. Oh, dear. Yeah, look at the look at the character picture now. He's got half a skull. There we go. Heal up. Okay, here's the blue key. So that will let us through the other door. Let's head down there. Oops. Oh, yeah, I accidentally used a nuke. Pressing the wrong key. Okay, now these are just a sort of trap of some sort, I think. Just bullets bouncing off the walls. So I'm just going to run quickly through. Grab these power ups and hit the gate. So there we go. We are now heading into Tower One. Move this slightly closer. Too close. Okay, Tower One. Tower One. Tower One. Let's see. We have. We're in a sort of golden tower here. Um, yellowy gold bricks. We head through these corridors. So. Again, it's mainly these little guys that are swarming around us. They're not, they're not really much of a problem, these guys. They're pretty easy to kill, and they tend to not really be able to get close enough to you to actually hurt, because they go down like one or two hits. Um, it's later on in the game when we start seeing more of the trolls and that kind of thing, that's when you start to have a little bit of trouble. So there's a red door over here. We're going to need to find the red key to get through that. So we'll head back this way. Uh, first of all, let's take these guys out. Oh, hello. Hidden area. A bunch of treasure. Okay, let's go round here. What's, what's this way, first of all? The red key, that will get us through that door. And uh, there's a yellow door down here as well. Let's, we've got the yellow key, let's go through the yellow door uh, while we're here. So what do we have? What do we have? We have some treasure, let's grab that, let's kill this guy. And slowly turning. Da, da, da. Here's a blue key, okay. Oh, hello. There's a couple of bolts as well. The other thing about this game is it's quite easy to get stuck on walls. Like if you're if you bump into a wall, if you're like at a slight angle, you you just stop moving. Um which is kind of annoying because it's difficult enough to turn as it is. You kind of get used to it after you've played it for a few minutes. 
Right, there's a green door. We don't have the green key yet, so we need to just move around here. I think this this is back at the start, I think this is where we started the level. We'll go around to the red door and hopefully that will contain the green key. I have a feeling it will. Okay, what's in here? Um, that's some treasure, first of all. A dark chamber. These little mini dudes. And the green key, there we go. So now we can go back to the green door and go through it. I'm going to assume we will probably see the blue door over there as well. Now, let's see if I remember the way back out. Oops. Bumping into stuff. There's the green key, or the green door even. And the blue door's right behind it. Cool. And there we go, the gate room. So, this is going to take us to Tower 2. Okay, let's, let's just quickly blast through Tower 2 as well. Um, so, we've got a red key pretty much immediately. And some of these guys... Da, 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 going through a hallway. Tower 2 is pretty short. So we've got a small hidden area here with some nukes and a portal. This is going to take us to access floor. This is the sort of hub level. Um, so I'm going to call this the end of the video and we will explore this level further in the next part. Um, hopefully I'll be able to see you there um, and we'll continue from where we left off. So uh, as always, you know, if you if you enjoyed this, um, feel free to give us a like, leave us some comments and uh, what else do you want to do? You can subscribe if you want to see more updates and that kind of thing. Um, and hopefully we'll see you back for the next part. Um, in the meantime, take care. Catch you later.